Hey guys, what's up? So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can generate VO3 videos using NA10 and the API from VO3 directly. I'm going through the whole step-by-step -step process here in this video and let's get right into it. So here we're on Slack. I have it on Slack just for um, to easily display the videos and also this could be used for businesses if they have a marketing team and they can have it in their marketing team um, channel. So for example, here I have VO3 AI creatives. This is where the marketing team would then put all the business info, the video settings that they want of the video, and then the video will get generated. Let's see the results. So that's one of the results that I have generated. Now let's actually go into how does this work. So this is how it works. It's a very simple automation workflow. The template will be in my school community, which you can find in the link um, below. So you just have to request to join and then we'll accept you. Uh, we have 400 plus members who are, who are getting all of this information before you. So you are probably missing out on a lot of value here. But anyways, let's get straight to the tutorial. So how it works is basically um, whenever someone sends well, the questionnaire into Slack. So let's say your marketing team, they want to do a new ad creative and they want to use VO3 um, video generation. So they'll just reply to a series of questions, which is a template that I made, which will also be available in the community so that you can easily use it. And then after that, that gets transformed into a code, which just very neatly um, provides well, the output of each reply um, formatted in, in a way where we'll be able to use this to create a prompt that will be put into VO3. So you have the first AI agent which just um, creates the prompt. Um, so the target audience, the uh, product that we're selling, what is the problem that we're solving, the transformation for the, uh, that the client is going to get when they purchase our product or service. In this case, it's when they rent a jet ski. In this case, it's when they rent a jet ski. Um, then the function, so what do we do uh, for the client? And then what do we want in the background? Then after that, what will happen is it will actually go in and generate the VO3 uh, prompt. So just in a better way for storytelling and, and that the video actually looks good. So in this case, it just wrote, well, the age range of the person, some kiss customer in trendy swimwear that channels summer freedom and fun with uncontainable excitement and adrenaline fueled happiness. And then it gives some um, context. Now, what is super important here is because, well, let's say if you're going to use this for an ad, you don't want to have um, like, a big view of the video. You want to have it vertically shot so that then it can be on the phone and you can use it as like a story ad or, or whatever, like TikTok content, reels, etc. like short form content. Um, so you want to be very specific with the nine to 16 aspect ratio. Um, and then yeah, what works super well is the POV footage um, of the person. So the person has their phone, is doing like if it's a POV, this is how you will basically create a proper ad or proper UGC AI generated content. But here we're using VO3, which is the best um, video generating uh, AI model out there. So the next step here is to, well, this is just create the title of the, of the video. And here we use this HTTP request, which is basically we're using file AI. File AI is a tool which allows you to create these videos. So here are a couple examples that I have made. Um, so this is the first one that I showed you. Now we can look at the second one. So I'm just going to open up that. So here's a second example. Incredible jet ski. Guys, I just had the most incredible jet ski adventure today. I used oceanrush.com and you seriously have to try this. So as you can see, the POV style really works well. Here there was an issue with the voice, but um, there's a lot of potential with this, a lot of potential. I can't believe I lost 15 pounds in six weeks with this program. Yeah, this one was not the best. And as you can see, it's a big format. We want um, like uh, for the phone, a phone ratio. This was another example that I made. Driving license in eight weeks. And it's pretty interesting where you can actually prompt for the person to whisper or to shout or to feel angry, to feel sad, to cry, etc. Like I think that is, um, well, that is what makes this very human is also the emotional side of the person that you're, well, the, the, the thing that you're generating um, in the video. And this one is also a crazy one. 
for sales outreach these days? We switched. What tools are you using for sales outreach these days? We switched to IMI calls last month. The AI calling is actually incredible, way better response rates. What tools are you using for sales outreach these days? We switched to so yeah, you get the point. Um, but basically, we connect to file.ai, um, the API um, webhook, and then that's how we're able to generate for the video automatically through API and use this in, a, in, a, in NA10 and then have it in Slack, etc. Then the two other nodes is one where basically uh, you would need to have a wait node in between around five to seven minutes. That's how long it takes to generate a five to eight second video. Um, so what I'll do is it'll just fetch the video when it's uh, when it's ready and then after that you have another HTTP node which will download the video um, and then that's how we're able to then send it into Slack which is uh, super valuable um, even let's say if you want to create a SaaS out of this or if you want to yeah have it internally for your team or provide it to your community or, or do whatever as an additional tool like you could put a paywall in front of this um, so yeah so a lot of a lot of things and having these different uh, webhooks where you can connect and retrieve videos, like this is what is super valuable in this case. Now, the only thing that we need to talk about it, is the pricing. It's actually pretty expensive. So if we go into the playground, it'll, it'll talk about the prices. So for every second, for every second of video you generate, you'll be charged 50 cents um, or 75 cents for the audio. For example, a five second video with audio on will cost you $3.75. So me, uh, with the tests that I have done for eight second videos, it has been costing me $6 per video. So yeah, it adds up very quickly. I think I spent like, if we go into my, into my, uh, into how much I spent. Um, yeah, I spent already $52 in like three hours with only six videos. Uh, so yeah, so it's, it's very expensive, but this is the only way, uh, especially if you're not in the US, where you can actually generate these types of videos um, and, and where you could actually provide it in a way where you can automate now uh, this system. So, so yeah, that's great. So the only thing that you need to do is you just need to download this template, install it, and then you have to set up the Slack uh, trigger, which I have made a video on how to create a Slack app. I'll link it in the video below, so then you can also uh, create your own Slack app if you want to. Um, but yeah, essentially here you already have the prompt and everything is, is configured in the right way. What we'll do is we'll do a last test now. I'll use the last remaining of my credits and then let's see what it creates. All right, great. So this is the template that you would get. You can remove these. This is not needed, but basically here you just have to uh, delete these and you just have to fill in basically and reply to the question. So what are we selling? What are we going to do is we're going to sell um, a tree removal uh yeah tree removal we do tree removals and in the website we can just say um get your tree removed dot com uh the target audience is um let's say uh wealthy home owners in london who need to remove a tree in their garden before it collapses on their mansion. Uh, the problem is, well, um, removing, the problem is the risk of uh, the tree of the home owner collapsing into their home and breaking everything if they do not remove the tree. I'm just thinking on top of my head here. Sorry if it doesn't make sense. Uh, the result, um, the tree is removed and the mansion and wealthy mansion has no damage and wealthy homeowner is not stressed anymore and happy what do you do we remove the tree by cutting it with a chain saw 
how long does this, uh, how long to get results as soon as possible. And then here, this is where it's important. This is the video settings. So the speaker, the person who will be talking, we can decide or it's the person who is going to remove the trees or it's going to be the person who, the homeowner who is stressed and who is panicked, like, oh no, I have a tree that's going to fall on my house. Um, what should I do? Uh, but yeah, what we'll do is like a customer testimonial. So we'll do happy customer um, and satisfied client uh, who is the wealthy home owner um, and who who got the tree removed before the accident. So the clothing would be, let's say like business casual, where they're filming in the back uh, yard of the homeowner of the mansion. What's visible behind them? Well, the tree being cut safely and the mansion that has no damage. I'm really curious of how this will come out or it might come out very bad, <laughs> but let's see, let's see. Either way, I'll keep it in the video, but the emotion is, let's say, amazed and relieved. Proof of item, we could just say like, hmm, the proof of item would be, yeah, the tree being cut behind safely and carried away from the, from the mansion of the wealthy homeowner, of the healthy, of the wealthy UK homeowner. Uh, wealthy, no, wealthy homeowner. All right, let's see. I'm very curious about this one. So let's just go back to the flow. Yeah, everything should be working. Just we need to make sure that the weight is set up. So here I'm going to send this message and it's going to trigger the, or it's going to trigger it. So boom sent it now if we go into executions as you see well it should be running here you go it's running if we go to foul.ai we should also see in the history so if we just go to vo3 and then we go to examples we should see the no requests we should see the history here so here you can see it's in progress no worries if it says no prompt it is still generating with the prompt and this should take about, yeah, you see like 140 seconds. So that's around two to three minutes actually. Um, but yeah, I just have seven minutes just in case it takes longer. So what I'll do is I'll cut until uh, the video gets generated. Okay, amazing. So the video got generated, let's see it. So here's your vertical home service video ad. It will help you build trust and showcasing the relief and satisfaction of safety removing hazard trees. So let's see. Guys, I experienced total relief as professionals swiftly removed our hazardous tree in no time. I used getyourtreeremoved.com and you see. Yeah, that's pretty good. Actually, just at the end, obviously it got cut because um, it's only eight seconds, but that's really good. Like we could cut it at this Are point and uh guys i experienced total relief as professionals swiftly removed our hazardous tree in no time i used getyourtreeremoved.com and then you would cut it here but yeah so that's how it works i'm excited to see what you guys do make sure to join the school and drop what uh and publish the videos that you created i'm very curious to see what kind of results you you all made the school group is free so so yeah just, just join get the template and let's see what you create okay see you guys in the next video bye bye